all, you need to find an image. So you load up Google Chrome. Where's the, yeah, the internet? Yeah. And then you're on Google. Yeah. 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 Type in. Flip. Flop. So whatever images I want. Uh, yeah. Out, 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 outline because it's easy to get an outline. Yeah. Uh, and it comes up with it like a load of it. Like you click on that bit. Yeah. And it, it comes up. It search for it searches for images only, not websites or anything like that. Right. Which one should I do? Yeah, that one. That one? Yeah. Alright, click on it. Yeah. And it'll come up bigger, yeah? Yeah. Then you right click on the image. Right click on the image. And then it goes save image as. Save image as, yeah. 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 And it'll come up with a box, alright, where to save it to. Yeah. Save it to your desktop. Okay. Alright, so you just remember where you've saved it. Yeah. Yeah. Desktop. It should automatically save to the desktop anyway. Mm. Right, that image is downloaded to your desktop now, so if you close this down... Wait a bit. Close what down? The internet. Right, yeah. It's here. Yeah? That yeah. image you've just been on Google Images is there, yeah? Yeah. Right, what you need to do now is go back onto the internet. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Bookmark here. Yeah, up there. And it'll load up your canvas. Mm -hmm. There. Yeah. Uh, and basically, you've got like here, you've got basic patterns yeah. that you can add to your canvas. Borders. Yeah, which I've already got those anyway. On your machine. Yeah. You've got logos. Yeah, I've got all them. Right. To get your own image that you've just downloaded, Yeah. click on image tracing. Right. Right. Yeah. And then it'll come up with this little section here. Yeah. Choose file. Now right. the file is your image. Right, okay. So click on that. Choose file. And it'll come up with the box again. And all you've got yeah. to do is find your image again. So you're on desktop here. So everything yeah. on your everything that's on your desktop is yeah. in here. Right. So you scroll down to all your programs, folders. Yeah. And so it's gonna be right down at the bottom there, isn't it? Is there. Right, yeah. Click on that and then mm. click open. Yeah, so open at the bottom one. And it? then it'll open it here. Yeah. Right. And you can choose whether you want to trace the outline. Where, where, where am I looking now? Here. Alright, oh, yeah. Choose whether you want to trace the outline or the colour. Mm -hmm. So we want so the outline, outline don't we? Will, no, you'd want the colour because you want the inside bits as well, don't you? Oh, right, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. You want the detail. Yeah. So I'd say... Uh, but why remove the background? Why have you got to remove background? It removes all... Like, if, if on this picture there was any background, there oh, isn't. Oh, right, yeah. It would remove yeah. that. Okay. Uh, and click OK. Where's OK? There. Mm -hmm. Where? I've just clicked OK. Uh, yeah. You'll see yeah. it when you're cracking your video. And it'll open it up here. It's not much of a, an image there, though, is there, look? No, but you can make it bigger. No, but I'm on about the shape of it. It's gone. It's not. And turn it all right. Right, let's make it a bit bigger. Highlight it all. Yeah. Where are the tools to do that, then? On your mouse, is it? Yeah. Isn't it the corner one? That's just stretching it, look. Yeah, stretch it that way. Yeah. If you use the corner, it drags in both. You can do it like that. How can you move it in proportion? Yeah, you re estimate, don't you? Well, no. If you drag the corner, that would have pulled yeah. it left ways and out, so it would have it in proportion. Okay. Right. So, right, so if I wanted to move the whole thing complete onto a bit of paper that I've got, which, which, which did you press then? Right click on the mouse, was it? Yeah. Yeah. Now, what it's left here yeah. is just the background of it in there. Mm. So forget that, it won't cut that. Right. It shouldn't do, anything. But it would do if it's scanning. Right. Yeah. So we've got our image ready to cut. Yeah. You can mess around with it, you can add text and stuff like that, but let's say you've got your image ready to cut, right? Yeah. Download. Yeah. 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 Basically, downloading the image you've just made off the internet. Yeah. And it comes up with this, yeah? This is your image.fcm file. Yeah. 
You click on the, on that. Yeah. Right click on it. Right click on it. Yeah. And then save uh, link as. Yeah. Similar to save Pull picture in. as. Yeah. Then when you did your photo. Yeah. Save link as. Save link as, then save it to your desktop again. Yeah. You can select where you want, but it'll automatically save to your desktop. Mm -hmm. And now that's saved to your desktop. Right. right. Can you just be quiet while I'm doing this video? Right, and then what? Right. We'll... Now you've got that file you just saved, it's called Untitled. Right. There. Yeah. No one needs to go and get your memory stick right there. So how many images can it be put on that uh, no. memory stick? No. No. Alright, put your memory stick into your laptop. Does it matter which port? No. Yeah. And wait, you'll hear a noise. Mm. And it'll come up here. This is your memory stick. And you, mm. you click on open folders to view files. Right, okay. Uh, and basically, just drag. Where have you dragged it from? Oh, from the, the desktop. downloaded image, the downloaded file you've just made. Yeah. Canvas you've just made. Yeah. That drag it onto yeah. your memory stick. Uh, onto do you want to replace it? That's the Fender one I just did. So you, what you want to do is uh, copy and replace it, or right, so you don't need it. to keep that. The reason why it's just, no, it's got the same file name. Yeah. Uh, so it's on your memory stick now. Right, so then I'll go and stick that in my brother scan and go. You know what I mean? Follow you. So what's happened to that fender now then? What can right, you do I got with rid that? Of that? You can actually save it to your machine. Yeah, but I don't particularly want to. Yeah. Delete patterns, yes. Right. Now what you want to do is pattern. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Then you click on saved data. And it's yeah. And then, then the USB sign. Yeah. And it's already automatically no, found. Right. So now, can I manipulate it while from yeah. the brother? So I can go back. Can I play with it on that? No, you know, like you it's on screen. Much. No, I don't think you can. So you've got to do all you cut. You've got yeah, to do your you sizing. Can in. You can actually. I think you can move it. Uh, right. So you can. You can size. You can move it. Yeah. And that's just scan. Scan them. Out. It's yeah. just a matter of, yeah. I basically go OK and then load your paper. You have to do yeah. all that, don't you? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Thanks, Carl.